Warning, this video contains mature content such as strong language, graphic stupidity, and intense moments that is not suitable for younger viewers. Viewer's discretion is advised. Damn, I'm so bored the blue team has not yet gotten to our control point yet. Maybe they are taking a break or planning on something. Scout, what are you doing in the middle of the hallway? Should you help with heavy engineering pyro to protect the control point? Oh, what's up, medic? They told me to keep a lookout and I did. I don't see any blue team all day, so they must have taken a break or planning. Besides, it's close to closing. Well, you may have a point right there on closing time. So if they are not doing something, so we should be all right until tomorrow. Sounds good, but what do you think our team would do until then? Hmm. Well, I heard there's a museum about the history of the Badlands. Maybe we can get Spy to get us to the museum and see what we know about the Badlands before this? Seriously? A boring museum? Why not something fun like amusement park or go to the pool, but you pick the museum? We can stop by to get fried chicken and bonk drinks after this if you go. Medic, seriously, that's your offer. You have to think more then? I'll set a date with Miss Pauling and you if you go. Alright, I'm down to go. Alright then, let's get the whole team on this trip and let's go! Alright, we are here. Let's hope that we can learn something interesting about the Badlands besides the fact we have fucked gray men before. So let's get inside. Hello and welcome to the Badlands History Museum. I see that you are all from the Mad Cole Freight Base, am I correct? Yes, we are. So why did you ask? Well, you see, this museum has had some difficulty since we fired our last employee who was a degenerate during the night shift. Let me guess, was this employee a scout? As a matter of fact, yes. It was the scout of Dustboard. Call that right then. All of you follow me. It's time that you all be educated about the history of the Badlands before man called. In the history of the Badlands, no towns form. Until in 1856, a new town was made, which is called Red Town. Who are those two guys in the pictures between the town picture? Ah, you must be talking about the, the two heroes of Red Town. The sheriff engineer and his partner, the Raging Heavy. They are the heroes that saved the people of Red Town. Let me tell you the story of how they became the heroes. It all started in 1887, where it was a normal day in Red Town. Man, there is nothing exciting today. We usually just stop the town drunk from causing a disturbance in the bar, but nothing is happening now. What do you think, Engineer? I agree with your partner. Nothing exciting is happening right now, but let's just kick back and relax until we heard some news. Hey there, Sheriff Engineer and Raging Heavy. Any new stuff going on? Hey there, Tough Boot Sniper. Nothing new yet, but we still have the wanted paper of the Fast Lightning Degenerates over there. Here to take the bounty hunting job to take care of them. These guys have been wanted since last month, and we need somebody to get to them before they would come to our town. I would love to, but I'm afraid that my wife would need me. So maybe another time when I'm not busy with the week, maybe Demo Man would help. He is so banal, so he is available. So where you think he is at now? From I can gather, I think he is at the bar, but we can catch him before he gets drunk again and would ruin the chance of helping us get those degenerates behind bars. Well, good luck convincing him to do the job of taking those criminals down, so I'll be going to the shop to buy something for my wife and me. See ya, guys. Well, let's go heavy. Let's recruit our new bounty hunter. Hey, the sheriff engineer and raging heavy. I guess you're here to stop me from getting inside the bar and cause a disturbance like last time. Not this time, Demo Man. We wanted to have you do a job for us to keep this town safe from those criminals that might come to our town. How would you like to be our bounty hunter and earn a reward if you capture the lightning fast degenerates? Hmm. Well, if there is a reward, all right, I'm in. But only if I get a new outfit while I go get those criminals. My cloths are pretty old and I do need new cloths anyways. You got yourself a deal, partner. You're hired. All right, so where do I start searching for them? For now, let's get the paper wicks done before we get this started. So come with us and we can get your bounty hunter job started so we can get those degenerates to justice. All right then. I can't believe they run us out of Blue Town. This was your fault, Spy. My fault. 
It's your plan to fool them to give us their variables, but then you went ahead and flirted with a bartender lady while we were getting overrun by the town. Yeah, not to mention our ammo was low. Were you supposed to help us restock everything while we are getting ready or you are just being lazy? Shut the hell up, both of you! As a leader, you don't question what I do. Besides, I had a twisted ankle that day. That was a lie and you know it. And we are sick and tired of y'all. Sick and tired of what, Spy? You know what, screw this. I'm gonna go take a breather in the other side of this camp far away from you guys. You all suck! I'm so sick of him. What you think we should do, Spy? Let's just leave him. We might see if he will change his attitude if we find the nearest spot to have him find us easily. Sounds like a good idea. That would teach him something about being a terrible leader to all of us, so let's get out of here. God, those idiots can't do anything right. Why can't I find a team then? What the hell? Spy, are you trying to prank me again? Enough of these pranks! What the hell? Spy, I have a feeling that Scout will not like this. Don't be a coward, soldier. You're tough-hearted, remember? Besides, Scout would deserve this prank because he treated us like he's not our friends, but more of a pawn to him. If we would have not pranked him, he should not be screaming in anger. <laughs> Wait a minute. That's not screams of anger, those are screams of terror! I should have known better! We better find him and... What the hell is that? I don't know, but whatever that is, it must have got Scout. We better... <coughs> Son of a cussing cussword! <coughs> <coughs> Crap, that was a long trip. The fast lightning scout hideout should be near, but I would surprise them. But first, I'll set up camp to rest and get to the hideout. Help! What the hell? What? Is it a Dallas? Easy! I require, I require assistance. assistance. That sounds like one of those wanted criminals I've been searching for. Why would they want some help? Even so, they are wanted. It don't matter now. What matters is that they are close and I must get to them, then get to the leader and have that reward. Wait a minute. What if this was a trap? What if they were trying to lure me into it and ambush me so they would get to the town? I'd better be careful before rushing in. But how would I get to them? I guess I can sneak up behind them and capture them from surprise and take them back to the town. For the love of God, why did Scout choose this forest as a hideout? He is the worst leader that we had until that werewolf got to us! Surprise criminal! Ah! <laughs> I have finally caught you, fast snake spy! Now where are the others? They are already gone. You won't get to them because they are. Save it till we get back to town! Hopefully, the sheriff would love to ask you some questions about your shenanigans and whatnot. So let's go! Hmm, it's quite without heavy around. It's too bad that he had to take the day off so he can take care of his sisters, but for now I will wait until Demoman comes back. I wonder if he already got to them or captured by those degenerates. Now thinking about it, if they would hide somewhere like in the woods, it would not be the smart choice. Besides getting lost and possibly ended up getting captured by other bounty hunters, they would end up running out of supplies and fate would soon come to them. But hopefully Demoman would get them before these criminals ended up pushing up daisies within the woods. Hey there, Sheriff! I found first snake spy, but I think the others got away. Thank you, Demo Man. I'll take it from here. I'll give you the reward after I put him behind bars for what he'd done. Do you think that you will find them? I was trying to say that they are. Tell it to the judge, partner. You will never get away with this this time. As soon as we find your friends, this town will be safe. Wild Wolf Demo Man, are you sure that the spy that got away from us is captured by the Red Town Sheriff and now is in the jail? That's right, Shadow Wolf Soldier. He is with Red Town, but he won't get away for what he did to our town. Besides, we werewolves never reveal what we are. So how do we get to the spy? The full moon is getting there. Let's get to the roof and let's wait. You're right. With us being werewolves, we are unstoppable during a full moon, but tonight is the blood moon. So this will be fun. What is going on here? Wait a second. You are from Blue Town, are you? Yes, we are, but we are not here to insult this town like we always do since our town have rivalries and whatnot. We are looking for somebody. Yes, we are looking for a wanted criminal and turn him into Blue Town. I'm afraid that you both are out of luck. He is already in jail and the reward is already given to the bounty hunter. So I suggest that you both would. What the hell? A red moon? 
I've never seen this. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, what's with the laughing? It's really quiet. Wait, the sky is red. No, the moon is red. But this could only mean. <laughs> Wait, that's the shopkeeper heavy scream. He must be in trouble. I'd better get to him before something will happen. Then I'll get the sheriff and have us find out what the hell is going on. Wait, is that a wolf's hat? Could it be a pack of wolves attacking the town? What the hell is going on? Ah! <laughs> Looks like this is your end. I'll be enjoying ah! Are you alright, Demo Man? Yeah, thanks, but I gotta get to the sheriff before another comes up. Leave that to me. Just get to the church where everybody will be safe. I'll get the sheriff and the fast snake spy to safety. What the hell is going on? I heard a scream and gunfire. What is going on? <laughs> no, dear God, get back. Crap, I better get to the spy. <laughs> no, stay back. Stay the hell back. Hold it right there. Well, well, the sheriff is right. I would love to stay and chat, but me and my wolf brothers must take this spy to us. Why do you want the spy? Answer me, you vermin. The degenerate scout and this spy and the soldier are responsible of almost causing our town's deeds stolen. So we werewolves decided to take actions within our own way. By destroying him, the scout and the soldier, we already taken care of the scout and the soldier, but spy ran away like a coward he was. So we will take him and finish this. I'm afraid I won't let you take him. Sheriff Engineer, fast! Snake spy, where are you? It looks like the hunter is here, but the blood moon is fading away. So, I will take my leave until the blood moon returns the next night. In the meantime, have your time ready for my pack. We shall declare this war against Red Town, and this time we will win. So be ready, Sheriff, because we will be back. <laughs> This is not good. So what the hell do we do? I don't know, but I think we got a bigger problem than we thought. We better call in a meeting and we might figure this out. We might as well prepare for what will happen, but we need an expert on this werewolf situation that is now going through. There you both are. We must go to the church for safety. Father Holy Spy, you're okay. But what is with these werewolves? I'll explain later. Now come with me. Alright, come on then. Let's get to the church. Father Holy Spy, what is going on? You know anything about the werewolves? Have you let me ask the question? Now, Father Spy, what do you know about those werewolves that got into our town? I'm glad you both ask. Those werewolves are not from Blue Town. They are known as the Shadow Werewolves of the Badlands. They have been around way before both Red and Blue Town was even built. But the strangest thing is that they should have been extinct when both towns were built. How do you know all of that, Father Spy? Because before I came to this town as a priest, I was a successful monster hunter in a group called the Monster Breakers. The Monster Breakers! As in the most famous legendary monster hunting organization from the war against the monsters of 1867. The very same, yes. Wait, I thought the Monster Breakers were just a legend. Don't tell me that the Monster Breakers are real life monster hunters! Oh, believe me, Raging Heavy. It's real all right. I was a commander of my own unit during the Monster Wars. When the war was over, I was discharged honorably. After that, I became a priest and moved to Red Town to become the town's preacher and forget the memories I had from the war. But it seems that my old enemy has come again. The Shadow Werewolves must have had a plan to evade capture by the Monster Breakers and must have taken territory between Blue and Red Town. Since one of the werewolves escaped, he will return, but this time with his whole pack that will be enough to destroy all of us in this town. This is really bad. Father Spy, since you're with the Monster Breakers, why not you help us defend this town from those vermin? I'm afraid that won't be possible. I cannot help you defend, but I will help keep the citizens safe from them. However, I'll help you all prepare for the battle against them. I have enough gear for a group in case this would happen. Sheriff, you will lead this battle and defend this town. We are counting on you and your group. All right, I guess me and Heavy will recruit more people for this battle. The old man is our bounty hunter, so he will help us. But who will also help us? Mind if I cut in this conversation? I will gladly help you, Sheriff. I'm risking you escaping for your crimes. Forget it, Fast Snake Spy. You're nothing more than a criminal and will stay in jail. Wait, Sheriff. Think about this. Maybe we can have him within our group. I have a better plan for the Fast Snake Spy.
We can use him as bait to get the werewolves to us, and we can destroy them once and for all and save the town. Besides, they are after him, right? So there must be a lot of werewolves that would surround the town, so this plan could work. That sounds like a good idea. All right, he is in, so have him prepare for tonight. Make sure he is ready to become bait for the werewolves. Oh, merde. Quit your complaining. You'll be behind bars anyways when we destroy them. Anyways, Father Spy. I think we need to recruit more people from the town, so give us every gear you got. We will be prepared. I'll do my best on helping the town and help you get prepared. But if you are overrun by those werewolves, there is a powerful artifact that will get rid of them. I'll explain later, so let's get this plan started. All right then. All right then. All right, is everybody ready? I am ready. Ready? Uh -huh. All ready to go. All ready, mate. All right, get in positions. Have you take the spy and put him with us. Demo man and Pyro, you protect the citizens while they get into the church for safety. Sniper, you get on the roof and keep on the lookout. Take out the werewolves from the roof the best you can. What about me? You also keep on the lookout too. Use the cannons to destroy those werewolves while Sniper take the rest out from far. Sounds good, everybody. Hey! Yes. Okay, mate. Uh -huh. The Blood Moon is now out. Everybody get in positions and be ready. Heavy is the spy ready. The spy is set where we are at. These werewolves should be coming in a line and we will bring them down. Damn it. These balls and chains are on my feet. I can't move. Wait, what's that over to the horizon far from here? Sisters and brothers of the pack, we shall take this town and destroy any humans that get in our way to stop us. Wait, Wolf Leader, isn't that the spy that we are going after? Well, they seem pretty smart about giving the spy to us. But I see this could be also a trap to destroy us, so I have a plan. Well, I'll be damned. Looks like they know just the bait they are. Wait, are they splitting up? Shit! I didn't think that they are smart enough to figure out we are fooling them to be destroyed by us. We must warn the others. No, we must go on and fight back. This town is our home and we can't let them destroy our home. If we get overrun by those werewolves, we will use the artifact that Father Spy gave to me as a final resort. You are right, Sheriff. My sisters and I have lived this town for so long. We must protect this town and our family and friends. For our town, for our family and friends. Damn right we are. Heavy, get ready to fight with me. Everybody fire. Firing cannon. Go, go, go. Tiger, steady, steady. <laughs> this is just too easy. Surprise. What the? <laughs> that sounds like Sniper's in trouble. I better get to him and- Surprise, moron! Looks like that's the last of the civilians in this town to send them to the church for their safety. We better report back to Sheriff Engineer uh... That sounds like the soldier! He must be in trouble! Where are you get the soldier and protect the church from the werewolves in case they get into the town? <laughs> yes, I'm sure. We can't let those werewolves take our town and destroy it. We must protect the civilians at all cost. So go and get the soldier and save him. Your cannon is destroyed. Now all I have to do is... Fire! 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 I'm alright. Thanks for saving me, Pyro. I must report this to the sheriff. Shit! There is no cannon werewolves! They are everywhere! The other werewolves are surrounding us. This could be the end. Wait a moment. I think I remember something that Father Holy Spy has given me before sundown. Well, what is it that he given you, Sheriff Engineer? Father Holy Spy has given me this spell book in case those werewolves would overpower us and would take over this town. So since it's happening, we shall use this book. Wait, I recognize that book. How did he have that book at all? That book is evil and will risk of releasing a powerful being that will possibly destroy us all. For God's sake, Spy, what choice do we have? It's either we use that book or we will all be the werewolf's dinner! Raging Heavy is right. We can't let these monsters win and destroy us all. We must use this book. Barpo Cavalto! Sheriff Engineer, what spell did you do from that book? Gentlemen, look up! I am here! Wow! A lot of werewolves around here! 
I'll simply send them away and banish every werewolf in the Badlands. Basbus Pronto! Oh Lord the Church, it's time for a full course meal for me and my pack. Wait, what the hell is that? Ah! Holy sweet Lord! That wizard is banishing every werewolf in the town and possibly the Badlands? Well I'll be damned! I never knew the wizard has the power to do that. Spy, you know who is this wizard? Yes, that there is the powerful wizard known only as Morasmus the Magician. He is very powerful, and will destroy you if you make him really mad or just summon him just for stupid stuff. He can also resurrect the dead and will summon his undead minions to destroy you as well. But I only thought he was only a legend, but now seeing this now, I couldn't believe it. Looks like that was the last of them. Now it's time to leave. Goodbye. Forever! Oh, thank God you both are all right and the best part the werewolves are gone. You both saved the town. We lost a lot of good men in the battle between the town and those werewolves. I'm glad that everybody is safe and sound. It was a tough battle, but we won the war against those werewolves. How about we head to the saloon and celebrate? We can't celebrate now. The saloon is closed until tomorrow morning and not only that the town needs some repairing. Father Holy Spy is right about the saloon is closed because of the war. But we can't celebrate too early until the town is fixed from the damage that those werewolves have done from the battle. I guess you both are right about that part about the saloon being closed and the town being fixed. But I'm sure that everybody in the town will have a peaceful sleep now that we defeated the werewolves. I hope so too, partner. Let's all get some shut-eye and tomorrow will be a brand new day for us. Alright then! So after the town was fixed, they built the statue in honor of the both heroes. But then, in the 1900s, the town was abandoned and the town was rediscovered in the 1950s. Then a decade later, Manco bought the town and destroyed it for landscaping, but not before they donated the artifacts of what remained of Red Town and people who once lived there. So what happened with the Raging Heavy and the Sheriff Engineer? A very good question. After the town was abandoned, the engineer decided to work for the police force in Texas before he retired and lived a peaceful life. The Raging Heavy and his family have moved back to Theohon Village in Russia. He also lived a peaceful life. So that the story of how the Raging Heavy and the Sheriff engineer saved the town. I got to say, what an amazing story that was about those guys. What about you, Scout? Honestly, I think it's a good story about how humans and werewolf have been fighting each other. But Morasmus in that war, that is something you would never hear every day. Right then. You all follow me, and the artifacts of Red Town exhibit will be in the room next to this room. This way. Well, gentlemen, it has been really nice being with you all in this trip. Now that the moment has passed, let's get back to work. Yeah! 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 Wait, Medic, what about our deal? The deal we talked about? The fried chicken and the date with Miss Pauling? What? That deal? Yeah, about that. I lied so you could come with us for some quality time. In my medical opinion, you need to get your hook up level up. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I kind of figured you would lie to me, Medic, which is why I'm now warning you about the werewolf here. Hold on, Scout. I know the story of Red Town was very interesting, but there is no need to make up stories about the werewolves that were gone ages ago, so you can prank us. So just drop it already and get back to work. Am I really making up stories, Spy? Because that werewolf is now behind you, and he is really, really hungry now. Ah! Ah! Same password! Holy shit, a werewolf! Scout was not lying after all. Quickly, gentlemen, enter the panic room and run like hell and scream like banshees. <laughs> nice job, Dad. That was an awesome trick to use with your disguise kit you have. The pleasure is all mine, my boy. Now that the prank is over with, how about that payment you promised me? Here, Dad. Buy Mom some nice, and also for yourself, too. A pleasure doing business with you to prank the red team. So, see you next week on your days off? Sure, Dad. And maybe we can go fishing on that week and have some father and son time? I know we hate each other, but you're still my dad. We will see about the fishing trip. But I promise you, boy, that we shall have our own father and son time. Don't you worry. Alright, cool. Anyways, thanks for helping me with the prank to get them back for lying to me, Dad. You are very welcome, my boy. See you soon. <laughs>